Good morning guys and welcome back to my channel and this is part 3 of Detroit Become Human and we're going to look at Marcus. November 5th 2038 9.58 a.m. You guys are going to see a very familiar actor in the next scene. I think it's a very creepy chandelier. Quite a big house. And I can see this guy's got money. Uh, looky, looky. A dinosaur. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees, 80% humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. Me your arm, please, Carl. No, Carl. Thank you. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Humans are such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. Take you to the bathroom now. Oh. Has anyone recognized him yet? If I say the name Bishop, does that ring a bell? Anything special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern Art. Mm -hmm. The gallery director left four messages asking to confirm your attendance. Mm -hmm. I haven't decided yet. We'll see about that later. Okay. What else? Just your usual fan mail. I've already answered. Mm -hmm. Any news from Leo? No, Carl. I can call him if you like. No. No, I don't bother. I'm starving. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. I do not know why I decided to make it so difficult just to get to the table. 
Just turn around, you asshole. I'm doing the reverse reverse. She was. Thank you, Marcus. Television. Tensions continue to rise on Arctic as Russia unilaterally declared the region part of its national territory. Several Russian warships have taken position in the Barents Sea since Saturday, and the Russian flag now flies over the island. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? I'm sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, Carl. So, at this point there is multiple things that you can do, unfortunately you can only do one thing at a time and once it's done the scene is over so you have to choose, a, you know just choose what you want to do, it's not going to matter anyway. Television off. Mankind is so depressing. Nothing but greed, stupidity, and violence. 5,000 years of civilization just to get to where we are. What are you reading? Plato's Republic. It's one of the books you recommended. So, what do you think? I quite like philosophy, I think. It asks the questions that I can't answer. You know, what is right or what is wrong, for example. It's not something that is so easy to decide. Asking questions that have no answers is part of being human, Marcus. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect yourself. Make your choices. Decide who you are and want to become. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone tell you who you should be. Let's go to the studio. This is one huge studio. Very nice though. Let's see where we left off. Remove the sheet. Okay, so there's a couple of places to clean, so uh, let's get to it.
I don't know why I did it, but I keep on walking past that little table. So, what's your verdict, Marcus? Yes, there is something about it. Hmm. Something I can't quite define. I guess I like it. The truth is, I have nothing left to say anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Carl. But enough about me. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting something. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. That is a perfect copy of reality. The painting is not about replicating the world. It's about interpreting, improving on it, showing something you see. Carl, I don't think I can do that. It's not in my program. I... Go on, go, try it. Grab that canvas. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist, something you've never seen. Now concentrate on how it makes you feel and let your hand drift across the canvas. Okay, at this point I can tell you guys that it doesn't matter what you choose, the painting at the end of the drawing will look exactly the same. Hey, Dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? It just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, no, I swear, it's not that. No, uh, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash, that's all. Sorry. The answer's no. What? Why? You know why. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd, rather, you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's, what's it got that I don't? It's smarter? 
more obedient, not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine! Leo, that's enough. Enough. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. You've never loved anyone. You never loved me, Dad. You never loved me. Okay, as you guys can see, there wasn't too much choices that we skipped. It's only what you wanted to read or what you wanted to do while um, Carl was having breakfast. And of course, cleaning the studio at the end, some of the stuff I missed. But otherwise, we basically went through the storyline as we would have gone through it anyway. It's straightforward. There's nothing that we really missed. So, up to this point, guys. So, thank you very much for watching um, this game. Watching my channel, supporting me. Please, remember to subscribe to this channel. If you want to see more content like this, ring the bell so that <laughs> ring the bell. Click on the bell icon so that you can get notified of any of my further uploads. And if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. Please give me as much likes as you can because the likes drives the whole algorithm of YouTube. Until next time, guys. Cheers.